my name is Lauren Hebbard and this is my channel. I post every single Friday and it is a hodgepodge of life and love and adventures and me just figuring out motherhood. So I hope you guys will join me for more adventures and subscribe and hang out with me. It's going to be a great time. This week's vlog, I'm finishing editing it right now and it is a hodgepodge. Um, we're gonna see a little bit of cleaning, a little bit of random breast milk freezing because I'm nursing my baby. I have a two month old and he is just growing so fast and he's such a joy and I'm exhausted, but it's beautiful and I love it. <laughs> random vlog this week, as always, I should just quit saying that because they're all random. They're all like, what did I shoot this week? I don't know. Next week I do have some cleaning to get done. So we might see me cleaning out the fridge, cleaning out under the sink, fun things like that. Enjoy this week's vlog. Wow, okay. I just put the baby down. It has been quite the afternoon, but look at that view. Oh my gosh, it is springtime here as I said in the last vlog and these days are just gorgeous. We had some rain and storms yesterday and today but um, the weather has been absolutely gorgeous and I'm loving it. So this week, one of my big things was to get my closet cleaned out. I did not do that upper shelf yet. I haven't gone through that, but my clothes were kind of all over the place as far as sizes go. And then that whole box is clothes that I wore before pregnancy. Um, and so, I needed to go through them and put them back in the closet. I needed to go through the clothes that I already own and just make sure that everything that's in the closet is something I want, like wear kind of thing. And I know that I'm in between sizes right now, heavily in between sizes right now, but I decided to pack up all the maternity because I'm not wearing any of the maternity anymore. I'm wearing the maternity pants a little bit, just like the sweats and stuff, because they're more comfortable. And then all the shirts and everything and the dresses I packed up. And then all my shirts I just went through and just made sure that all of the clothes that were in my closet are ones that I either can wear now or will wear again. And then bras. <laughs> I had a whole box of bras and I was like, okay, well, some of these are really expensive, nice ones that I bought before the baby. I will wait and see if they'll fit me when, you know, I've lost the weight and gotten back down, but I know that sizes have changed, so possibly not going to be able to wear those again, but I decided to keep them. Needed to go through it anyway, because there were definitely some in there that needed to go bye-bye. So the box on the floor is giveaway. The box on the toilet is all maternity. That some I'm sending to my sisters um, and some I am keeping. And then, yeah, here's the closet. There's the before. And I know that there, it looks like there's more clothes in it now, but it's because I had two boxes of clothes to go through. And there's the after. And it feels so good knowing where all my stuff is in the closet and where all my clothes are. Okay, so we are going to vacuum seal breast milk. So my mom is friends with a gal that works with the company that has a vacuum sealer and she was wanting me to do a little piece on vacuum vacuum sealing breast milk so we froze it in that little ice cube thing and then once they were frozen we popped them all out and well my husband put together a little bag for it and then we vacuum sealed it because supposedly you are able to keep breast milk for a longer when it's vacuum sealed as opposed to just frozen in the little like uh, breast pump bags, you know what I'm talking about? So we vacuum sealed it and Roots and Harvest is the company that my mom knows the gal of and does reviews and stuff for. So yeah, we'll see how it goes. All right, these were fantastic. If I can find the recipe, I will link it down below for you. They were streusel muffins, but they were cupcakes literal cupcakes also oh my gosh atlas is holding a toy for the very first time in this video i know it's the wrong direction i just pulled out my camera roll fast to videotape it and i just think it's the stinking cutest thing seeing him hold a toy y'all he's getting so big he is so much more aware of stuff he's watching things like this right here <laughs> I put on Winnie the Pooh the other day and I was making lunch and he was just chilling in his little bouncer watching Winnie the Pooh. I loved it. 
And then I squat down to talk to him. And so then he's watching me, but he's just so much more alert, aware. His motions are more fluid. Today, we almost got a chuckle out of him. It has been so much fun watching him grow and develop. And yeah, I love it. Okay, that's all for now. Oh my gosh, she's getting so big. <laughs> I can't even stand it. I cannot believe how fast he's growing. He's almost 14 pounds. He is a huge boy. But thanks for hanging out with us this week. We are so thankful for you. So thankful for everyone who's subscribed and follows on this crazy little snippets of life that I share with you guys every single Friday. So we love you. We're so thankful for you. And we'll see you guys next week. Bye, y'all.